All right, so I'm actually surprised. I'm actually really surprised that there's not more hype around these Jordan 11s. I got exclusive access on the sneakers app. They don't drop for, I don't know the date. I'll put it somewhere here. So the Air Jordan 11 Cherry is beautiful. And I don't know why more people aren't excited about this shoe. I'm not even an 11s guy. I've got my classics. I got the Breads, Space Jams, Concords, Cool Grays. I need those, all four of those. Yup, some of the other stuff you can miss me with. When I saw this colorway, I got PE vibes. I got Blake Griffin PE vibes. The simple red and white colorway works perfectly on the Air Jordan 11 in my opinion, although it's flashy. This is a flashy shoe. The model itself is very eye-catching, obviously, with that patent leather, and anytime you add color to patent leather, it's gonna get some attention. These shoes are perfect for the holidays. And speaking of the holidays, we gotta talk about gifting because you have to buy gifts for the people that are important in your life, which brings us to today's video sponsor, which is Bombas. If you're unfamiliar with Bombas, they make incredible socks, underwear, t-shirts, slippers, and everything that you wanna have to stay cozy right around this time of year. I bet there's a lot of people out there that don't even buy socks. They just get them as gifts and that's how they fill their drawers. They just get socks as gifts. I respect your hustle if you're out there. Now, return the favor. Go buy socks for other people. Bombas is perfect for it because they've got every single sock under the sun, crew cut, low cut, no shows, knee high, everything. I prefer crew socks that go right up to the calf and these whites go perfectly with the Jordan 11s. You gotta go with some crisp whites when you're rocking this shoe for sure. So if you go ahead and get these, buy yourself a pair of these socks. I'm gonna link it for you guys down in the description as well as a promo code that I have. If these socks are too basic for you, they have every single pattern and material that you could imagine. Honestly, it's fun to get in a crazy pair of socks or just to gift that to somebody if you're doing some random swap or just get a few pairs, especially because they're on sale right now, and keep them around. So that way, when you do need a last minute gift, you have something to give to people. And please keep in mind that every pair of socks that you buy from Bombas, they donate a pair to a homeless shelter. It is the winter, it is cold, people are less fortunate. You buy 10 pairs, they're sending 10 pairs to a homeless shelter because homeless shelters cannot accept used socks for obvious reasons, sanitary issues, they need them new. The sale from Bombas is going to end soon and if you want them for the holidays, the cutoff is gonna be soon as well. So make sure you check the link down in the description and get some gifts for other people. Let's get into the rest of the video and style these beautiful Air Jordan Cherry 11s. Okay, first things first, listen, I try to dress up my Jordans as much as I can, make them more of a menswear shoe. With the Jordan 11, especially this one, not gonna happen. It is a casual or streetwear shoe. These outfits kinda reflect that. Secondly, a lot of times when I do these videos, I provide the links for everything I'm wearing in the description, not this one. This isn't gonna be that type of angle. I'm more so talking about colors and coordination all together with these two outfits. First up, get yourself some forest green sweatpants and pair them with these 11s. I know it's not necessarily the first thing that's going through your mind, but holidays. Think the holidays and just in general, I think that these two look good. Not a lot of people would think to mix them. So you're not gonna have the same outfit as someone else out there. So the colors that you'll see with this one are a tan, a red accent on this Sherpa jacket, navy and red on this Braves hat, and then green with the sweatpants. So the sweatpants provide that contrast and they're a cuffed retro jogger. So they really show off this entire shoe and you can see some of the socks that you're wearing. This Sherpa jacket is from The Gap. It's like five years old. I showed it to you guys a long time ago. Find something that's got the tan and the red as an accent color in it. You don't wanna go with too much red. This is probably maxed out as far as the red goes. So for me, this is that Christmas shopping outfit that I'm running errands, I'm on the go around the holidays when you're not like wearing Santa 
on a sweater or something, but you got those holiday Christmas colors going. So let me know what you guys think. If you get down with these type of outfits around this time of year, or do you not even pay attention? This is a good way to be festive with your outfit without being like corny or over the top. It's just fitting for a December or early January look. By the way, these Jordan 11s fit true to size, maybe comparing it to older models that it's more on the snug side. So if you're typically between sizes, you could probably get away with going up, but TTS should do the trick. Let's move on to that second outfit. Okay, so for this look, again, pay attention to the colors. On these Jordan 11s, you've got white and you've got university red. There's no black. A lot of times on white and red Jordans, there is a presence of black somewhere on there because of those Chicago Bulls colors, not these. This is pretty much just white and red. So because of that, you can incorporate navy. A lot of times when there's too much black on the shoe, I just write off navy. I'm like, it's not gonna work. You can't wear navy and black. Certain situations you can, but most of the time, no, but because these are just those two colors, you can wear navy here. So I threw on this vintage Christian Dior track top. Now, I'm super excited about this zip up. It's really cool. It's from, I believe, the late 80s, and it's got all these different colors in it. So it's pretty much predominantly navy, but you do have a little bit of red on there as an accent. They kind of resemble flags throughout this jacket. It's a satin, so it's got a nice sheen to it, similar to the sheen on these Jordan 11s. There's also a few other teals and whatnot, so it's not super matchy, but it's still flows. I was in between going with some navy or gray sweatpants, but I wanted to throw on jeans just to show you guys how these look with denim. I didn't want to go back to back sweatpant looks. Got to give you guys a good solid on feet and full outfit look. So find some vintage track jackets with these. It doesn't necessarily have to be Christian Dior. This is kind of a gem. There's plenty of other Nike jackets out there from the 90s that have better quality than the ones that are available now. You know, get some green sweatpants sweatpants. Nike actually does have some affordable green sweatpants that will work for that outfit. I'll link what I can down in the description for you guys. And of course that Bombas sale is linked down below as well. That's it for me. Hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed this one and found it helpful. Subscribe if you're new around here. I'll catch you next time. Peace.